to the show. You know, I'm on... Okay, that's enough of that. Welcome back to Yakuza Kiwami. I haven't been playing this as much recently, mainly because I've been distracted by Octopath Traveler. But today I don't really feel like dealing with uh, unplugging and plugging cords in. So <laughs> decided to go with the easy route and display Yakuza. Aw, oh, darn. I remember last time we played, Majin was hanging up around off the street up here. So, but, anywho, um, if we sit and let Q smoke a cigarette, he'll tell us what we're supposed to be doing, I think. I think. Alright, I'll ask you to worry about Mizuki's tattoo. Carlos and Rujin Hall is right behind Pig Street. And our inventory, I think, is... Wow, we have a lot for abilities. Uh, we're full up on health items at the moment. Definitely need to spend some of these. So let's do that first. Boost attack damage too, that would be helpful. So let's work our way over to that. But yeah, uh, today was a pretty good day, I think. Reduce the damage when Kiron only activates when you're calm. I did work. Um, it was the last day of the Lead Dev Live conference. It was a virtual conference. And it was it was fun. Um, I didn't get to enjoy as much of the conference this time as I did yesterday just because I had more like actual work going on today that I needed to pay attention to and I couldn't uh, couldn't just hang out and enjoy the conferences but it was fine there's not the boost attack damage that I want but in the meanwhile what are the ones over here okay there's another boost attack damage I figure that it's probably worth it to build up these lower levels and get the boost so that we can take people down a little bit faster and such because the boss battles have they have taken a good amount of time so there's that and I feel like I was trying to go after something I just don't remember what it might have been a natural ability That sounds good. Um, I think the two... The two, uh, the two talks that I think were probably the most interesting to me was one about uh, hiring. I don't really taunt, I don't really think I need to do too much in there. was one about hiring. Um, There's some interesting stuff about there, um, just because I've had to hire people before and it's not always particularly fun. Um, and some good tips, I think, from that. I don't have my notes in front of me, unfortunately, because they're on my computer. But I think it's probably fine. The fate was seen. When your first attack after the start of the battle, something Sure, I'm, we need this to unlock whatever's floating around around here, so. Being drunk makes you immune to studying. That's great. I think I'm gonna throw a good chunk of things into the heat gauge. Make things a little bit better. And then the rest of them. Ah, oh, shoot. Well, I don't have enough for the rest of them. Yeah, well, that's that seems good, I guess. I guess. I don't... <laughs> honestly don't really know. Um, I think that's for Beast, though, so I'll grab that. 650, clothesline bash. All those are 50. 
Quick steps. And we'll increase the number of combo hits we have. That's always a good idea, I think. And getting up quickly too. So there goes 200 points. Nice and easy. Perfectly. Perfectly set on how many points I had. So. But yeah, it was it was a good conference, I think. Even though I kind of missed most of the second half of it. But it was good. And then besides that, I just had a lot of meetings. Which, unfortunately, one of them... I get... Oh, well, that's the guy I probably need to talk to, right? Because it's an uh, ink store. My back's filled in already. Boy. <laughs> that's good. Like, oh, yeah. Yeah, it's a Yakuza. It's fine. He doesn't need any more tattoos than that, I think. Ooh, respect. Yes, セラの葬式であの大暴れか。どうした。墨でも入れ直しに来たのかいえ。この文様は月下美人だな。一年に一晩しか咲かねって花だ。実は、この入れ墨、俺が掘ったって言いてえのかうん、確かにこれは俺の
where you are responsible for setting up a meeting of any kind with people and then, you know, kind of driving that meeting. For the love of God, please, please have your shit together before the meeting starts and don't waste people's time. It happens so often with, uh, with one of my coworkers. I really wish that it would, uh, they'd shape up. But, that's, that's all. That's gonna be my, my one little bit of negativity today. Instead, let's go into the game arcade and see what's going on here. There was a kid we talked to in here before. Is it this little guy? Yes, the well-bred boy. Oh, mister! You actually showed up! Yeah, I'm a little curious to see what this mesking card game is all about. <laughs> All right, I'm sure it can be appealing to adults, too. Pretty sure it's meant to appeal specifically to adults. But what if it isn't? That should be a family game and purely for games. You can play Mask King using this machine. The story behind Mask King is that good insect fairies need to fight against the bugs that suddenly turn bad. Use four cards to make a deck, an insect card and three skilled cards. Insect cards are summoning an insect in the battle, while skill cards are ability for your insect. So, since you found my card for me the other day, I want to give you this. We got the Japanese Rhino Beetle. Face washer. Oh, masher, sorry. Omni choke. Win with East activate. That's just a skill card thing. And body slam. Okay. Are you sure you want to give me all these? Oh, don't worry. Those are all double the cards I have. Besides, I always love making more friends to play with. I'm not sure I'm ready to play this. I have no clue what kind of game this is. Eh. Well, that's where I come in. I'm famous around here. Who know me as Professor Mesking? <laughs> I'll teach you everything you need to know. Whenever you get a new card, make sure to throw it to me, okay? Professor Besky? What a nickname. And let me know if you want to play against me. Uh, uh sure. Thanks. So, oh, Mesky. I'll give it a shot. Alright, I'm, I'm kind of curious about this. Okay, so... Is this it? Hold on. Kira Meki? Oh, it's a photo booth. Okay, what's, what is this? Tell me I get to pose them in silly things. Yes. Um, okay, let's see it. Let's, let's go with the heart. And then money. All right, step up to the camera. Oh shoot, I messed up. Okay. Oh, oh, I get it. You have to wait. Spider-Nah. <laughs> oh, clearly this one is the best. We've even got the uh, adorable machine voice. Alright, now that I kind of understand this, and I know that I get CP from it, Let's uh, do this a few more times. I want to see the di at least all different poses. Uh, I don't know about that one. I feel like that one's the easiest to pull off. The deep thinking about the bug beauties. That's important. I want to get the, um, the Y one a little bit better. I get the perfect shot. Oh, 
Oh, I think I got it. <laughs> Good turn. Very vogue. I only have to do it five more times with perfects and then we get a point. I really just enjoy that pose, it's really silly. So I need five more so we can do a... We only have to play it two more times. So bear with me why I do this if you don't mind. Uh, the other thing I've been doing recently, um, I, I figured that it might be a good idea for me to branch out a little bit. Every now and then I get the urge. I wonder if the poses are different for uh also I messed up. Oh a little early. Well, that one had to be perfect, right? No. Okay. Um So I decided to branch out a little bit and mainly just to have something on when I'm kind of fiddling around uh doing work and everything like that. I threw on the first season of Bob's Burgers because a lot of my friends like the show. And like I've heard plenty plenty of uh, you know, references to it and everything like that like every single woman in my office going, Yeah Yeah all the time, which is rather obnoxious so I messed up. Um but, you know, I figured I'd watch it because I do like, uh, what's his name, John H. Benjamin, I think is the name of the voice actor who does the, uh, does Bob's voice as well as, uh, Archer's voice from Archer. And I watched the first season and, uh, maybe five, four, maybe like four episodes into the, uh, second season. And it's, it's pretty good. Like, I laughed a good number of times, but at the same time, sometimes it's just like... Eh, eh, it just kind of seems kind of stupid. <laughs> One more. Alright, come on. Don't make me do this again. Yes. Um, it's fine. It, if it makes you laugh, it's good, though. But the characters are kind of fun sometimes. I think I like Louise the most. Yeah. I think I like Louise the... Uh, the more evil of the daughters. <laughs> Just because she tends to be amusing, I think. Oh. Uh, it's fun, though. But I definitely prefer Archer, I think, as far as those kind of shows go. Yeah. You gave me a Mexican guard. At least I could do is give the game a fair shot. <laughs> I need you to say yes, mister. Well, first, you can try practicing with me. Okay, sure. Okay, but first, each method can cost a hundred yen. That's okay? Wow, kid. Uh. Sure. He's, he's got to make money somehow so he can keep playing. Alright, choose attacks in a set order, rock, scissors, and paper. You want to choose attacks that beat them. Paper, rock, then scissors. Okay, paper, rock, then scissors. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why, I enjoy, like, title screens that just say the name of things. Um, okay, he said... Rock, paper, scissors? I don't think so. It's not letting me change anything, so I assume that it's being smart. Yes. Okay, so is this just rock, paper, scissors with bugs? What? <laughs> Her face mashers, Max! Okay. Do I... do I need to press a button besides stuff? This reminds me of the wrestling game in Zero a little bit. Oh, she has really nice eyes. Yeah, I think, if I remember right, the wrestling game was kind of similar. They're so shiny, though. 
Do I actually control them? Okay. It worked. Perfect. It's really too bad that I already forgot what he told me to do. You can do it, Rhino Beetle. Okay, I don't know why. It's... Okay. I, I have no idea what I'm supposed to press. Let's use the finishing attack. This is cartwheel kick. That'd be a lot of force. I'm not. I'm not doing too well here. Ooh, that sounded bad. I wonder if any of the any of the models in this are the same. Ow! Same as the one from the wrestling match before. Womp womp. I like that all the beetles are the ones who are in the crowd and they're cheering for them. Pretty good. <sighs> Todio choose rock, scissors, and paper in that order. Oh. Oh. Okay. Let me... I don't really want to play again, but... Okay. Give me the practice round. I just want to win it. We we'll choose rock, scissors, then paper. So, paper, rock, scissors, or P R S. Pres. Paper, rock, scissors. Paper, rock, scissors. Paper, rock, scissors. Paper. ジャズ。次は投げ技を覚えさせるんだ。ペーパーロックスズ。これでいいかい?お前をメスキングにしてやるぜ。はい、ペーパーロックスズ。私と一緒に踊りましょう。え、プリース。ディスケ。ジャズ
Oh, look at the silly monkeys over there. All right, well, we can try again. We'll be, uh... Uh... Try this. I did play a few UFO catchers when I was in Japan. Mainly, uh... There was one that had a keys and eye figurine in it. And I tried decently hard to get it, but it didn't work out. Sadly. I wonder if I still had the picture of it. I got it almost to the edge. Like, I had lifted it up a number of times. But... It didn't quite make it there. Try this. Oh, that's a bit too far back, I think. But we'll see. Who knows, maybe if I knock this one forward, I'll knock some others forward. Lift up his butt! But stuck. <laughs> yeah, apparently I went too far back. I feel like the UFO crane games were a bit easier in Yakuza 0. Either that or I'm, you know, just not doing as well. Drat. Try again. I think that's decent. Should be able to get, like, near its feet. Wait, why did it only go down that far? Huh? Oh, it was going for the back one. Whoops. That's annoying. There needs to be a fast forward button. <laughs> Wait. But I... Okay, whatever. You can do it, Kiryu. Oh, I think I'm a little bit too far. Oh, it's on it though. Oh, there we go. We got the bird with the little tie. Omedeto! Omedeto gozaimasu! Boon-chan, the sparrow. Oh, I still got my other turns. Alright, let's go for the one in the back first, since it's not going to let us really go after the other one until we get the others. I like this silly music. Maybe a little bit too far back, it looks like. I wonder if they're plushies or if they're ceramic. Mm. I think we're too far to the right. And I think I went too far back again as well. Oh, maybe we went too far to the right. Actually pretty decent, I think. It's just too far back. Uh, sorry, little birdie. Yeah. There was also a really cool game in one of the arcades that I went to. Um, that was... It was like... Sort of like little egg cartons. And you had to get little ping pong balls into the circles. And if you got them in... Excuse me. Into specific ones, you would get... Um, a prize. And it was a figurine, which was pretty cool. Ooh, fuck him. Very sorry about the noise bothering you. Customers have said he hasn't won any UFO catcher prizes. Spent over 10,000 yen, and I've got nothing! Look, like it's not even possible to win something. Ah. So that's what's going on. What do you want so badly? A white boonchan. Hmm? Boonchan? Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a boonchan bird. A stuffed white java sparrow. 
The little girl keeps asking for that white boon charm. Says she wants it more. Says she wants it more than anything. The whole world. Your daughter sounds pretty demanding. <laughs> well, you see, she's not exactly my daughter per se, but she does like to call me her daddy. So, yeah, I, I've got the same expression on my face. <laughs> Don't make me say that stuff out loud. It's embarrassing. So, you're determined because you're her uh, daughter, big. Yeah. Yeah, it's rare that she asks for something. Of course, when she does, it's not money or something I can just buy. These types of games just come naturally to some people. Some are naturally good, others are naturally bad. Whoa. Oh, I know. You have to get a hold of a white boonchan. Could you let me have it? What? Please, I need that white boonchan, no matter the cost, I'm begging you. Oh, there's something on the floor. Don't be stupid. Why would I want to do that for you? They'll pay you loads of money for it. Please. Sorry, but I don't have that stuffed animal. Oh, really? Hold on, there's something on the floor. Oh, it's an insect. Kuwana's ladybug. Good outfit. Not really terribly excited about, uh... Wait. Didn't... No, I have the pink one. Is it possible to get him to reset the machine so I don't have, like, the horror show over here? Which one's the white one? It's not the one that's upside down, I assume, right? Or maybe it's the fat one. Probably the fat one. So he's red. Uh, okay, whatever. Like, I can clearly see that there's a pink one. But then he's... I mean, he's white and orange, I guess. I just figured it was going based off of uh, his hat or something. Ah! Uh, I really don't think we're going to manage to get this little guy. Mainly because of his friend taking his butt in the air. That is our fault, but still. Ah, it would have been so good if it wasn't for his friend. Okay, he moved him over a little bit. Maybe I can manage to get the claw, like, in between them if I try. These games are fun, though. In games and in real life. Gonna go a little bit too far left. That way, hopefully, the right claw will be in between them. Uh, nope. Have to go a lot farther. Okay, but we've... Oh, 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 yes, this is good. This is good for both of them, because now they're both in a good position. They should be easier to pick up the way they are now. Should be in the operative word. We'll go for the one on the second floor first. Or, I don't... The second level? Second level. Oh, that might not... Oh, no, it was good. It's good. We're good. It should catch him up. <gasps> Come here, little Boon John. I wouldn't be surprised if he falls out on the way over, but... Bonk. Congratulations! Omedetou gozaimasu! Alright, there we go. We got the white boonchan. Um... I still have two turns. So despite the fact that we already got him... It's gonna... It's gonna use up the other coins, because it's fun. Even if it does make somewhat slightly obnoxious noises. But yeah, Bob's Burgers is, uh... It's fun. I've enjoyed it. I'm probably gonna watch more of it just because it's something easy to have on. And if I put on anime while I'm working from home, then I'm gonna be more inclined to watch the anime because I want to watch, like, the subtitles and everything, so... 
Like, unless I put on something that I've already seen a million times. Or something that I actually don't mind watching in English. Like, um, Outlaw Star is, uh, is a show that I don't mind watching in English. Same with, um, well, Cowboy Bebop's a given. It's like one of the best English dubs that there is. Ghost Stories is another great one. Oh, come on. Lift up his butt and drop him in. Just, just knock him a little bit. No? We're so close. But, shit. I didn't mean to, to let go. Alright, well I guess we're going for the pink one. Bum, 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 bum. One of the other games that I played in the arcade when I was in Japan was uh, the FGO Arcade, which is fantastic. I really enjoyed it, mainly because I'm a massive fan of the series. So it was just really cool to see like actual 3D models running around of the characters that I like. So, and not to mention, I think it's really cool how they you print off a card, or rather, like the cards that you summon get printed off for you, and they have uh, RFID on them. And so you, like, the cards that you carry around that you get printed off are actually the uh, units you use and the, like, equipment cards and everything like that. So, it's pretty cool that they managed to do that. And it's saved, like, on the card themselves. So, this, it's just cool to have something, like, physical to hold on to. It was probably one of my favorite souvenirs. Next to, um, a couple of pieces of pottery that I was given as a gift from uh, some people that I met there. So, you know, it was, it was fun. Alright, last turn. And then I'm done with this. For real sees. <laughs> and then we'll give the businessman his white thing and he'll give us some money, hopefully. And hopefully it will be actually like a decent amount of money and worth it. Hello. That was almost good, if it wasn't for how big its hat is. Okay, we're good. Thank you. Alright, where's businessman? Hey, businessman. I... I do indeed have one for you. What should I do? Give him the toy! This is the one you're looking for, right? You handed over Boonchan the Java Sparrow. Wait. You're a much kinder person than I thought you'd be. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, if you don't mind, may I ask what your name is? Q. Q san. Got it. I definitely won't forget your name. Oh, sorry for being rude. I'm Sasaki. I know it isn't much, but please take this. A thousand yen. Just how much he spent on uh, trying to get it. This seems like a lot for a little toy. Are you sure? Yeah. Absolutely. It's much cheaper than how much I'd end up spending trying to get it myself. I'll be sure to let you know if I need something. Bye. Thank you very much. Yeah. It's uh, good. good money for the little toy. I probably won't go back into that arcade for a while. <clears throat> We've had our, our fill of random noises. Oh, I see you, Majima. I think. Right? Is that him? No. Bonk. There you go. Took one out in each style. Not bad. Where's... Where's Majima, though? Uh. 
Oi. Oh ho. Ho ho ho. What could be in here? Oh. Uh, dang it. Repair kit. It sucks. Also, it feels really weird to go into Serena from the front door. ハルカは登場会に狙われてる。連れ出さねえとまずいぞ。才の河原が一番安全だろう。ここに遊びに来たんじゃないの。おい、ハルカ。このペンダントでしょ。このペンダントがみんな欲しいんでしょ。私なんてどうだっていいんでしょ。おじさんだってきっと 100億円 ねえ、教えてよ。なんとか言いなさいよ。Sayonara. Haruka. Haruka. Feisty and stupid. She's a little kid though, so she gets a pass. I was expecting him to like lecture her a little bit more or something after he slapped her though. You know? Sorry, Date. Mazizo, Kiryu. Oikageo. And I know. Kiryu chan. Oh well, what about you, little doggy? Woof woof, okay. I bet you we're gonna find her, uh, like, with Nishikiyama. Like, he's gonna catch her, and then maybe we'll have to fight him, or he'll, like, take her away and we'll have to go get her back or something like that. That wouldn't surprise me if we had to do something like that. Yeah, give me the, whatever this is. The stag, be oh hey, we fought her. Aruka! Aruka! Doko deska? Doko ni maska? Aruka! Aruchan! Doko! Doko ni ikimaska? Doko! What's up, goons? Oh, and Dante is with us, so we actually have backup. Nice. We definitely do a lot more damage than we did previously. Oh, hey, hey, none of that to Dante. Kind of fun when you have a buddy with you, though. Okay, so we had to ask about her. What about this guy? No. Alright. The other thing that I've been doing with my free time, besides playing Animal Crossing, what have you, of course, 
is um, is watching an old playthrough of Vine Sauce playing through Chrono Cross. Because I watched his Chrono Trigger stream, and that was good. Um, good game. I've, I've played it a little bit before, but never really got too far past. I think I got to the future, and then didn't get much further. Oh, talk to the informant. That makes sense. Ah, Kiryu-san. やっぱりご無事だったんですね。よかった。あれ声かけられなかったんですよ。そうか。あいつはまだ店にいるのか。いや、ちょっとそこまでは。でも店の客に聞けばわかると思いますよ。わかった。ありがとう。All right, over to the game center we go. Oh, to that game center. Okay, that makes sense why you saw it now. I was thinking to myself, I was like, it's all the way across town. How did he see that? But if there's two, then yeah. Oh, is this the one? Mm -hmm. Hey, buddy, you see a little girl? Change the UFO prize. Oh, okay. I get it. Thanks. Hey, did you see a little girl? And you did nothing. Good job. Good job. Yeah, Chrono Trigger was definitely more easily understandable than Chrono Cross for sure though. Just because there's not two alternate worlds and crazy weird dimensional bending stuff going on. But I have been enjoying the stream nonetheless, mainly because um, watching Vine Sauce is just an amusing fellow. So. And I've been watching because of the because of the virus and everything. He's been doing earlier streams and playing Animal Crossing, which is nice. Um, he was saying he was feeling a little bit burnt out yesterday. With just like, you know, basically being live for like five days in a row. I I really didn't need to do that. Date is over here. Come on, Date, you do it. Come on. There you go. No, Date, I want you to do it. Come on. Nice slap. Alright, again. Hey, how much time? He barely even moves the health bar. Oh, right in Dante's crotch. <laughs> okay. So, down at the park. Gotta get Haruka. Hi. My name is Sir Bikes Lot. Would you like to find out why? Oh, I think... Ah, uh, maybe not. I thought I'd managed to hit the quick time event for once. Wait, this is... Brawler? I think it's Brawler that lets me disarm him. Oh, no, no, it's Dragon. Hold on. Oh, never mind. Oh boy. Chicken mice down, Date. Date's got some pretty spry moves for our kids. For, uh, I don't know how old he is, but he's definitely at least 40. I mean, if Kiryu's 37, I think, right? 
and he's known Date for a while. I don't know, I guess Date's like maybe 20, or sorry, maybe like 50 years old or so. At least. Maybe, maybe not 50. He's still got all. He doesn't have any, uh. He doesn't have any grays. Alright, the entrance is around the corner. Alright, Haruka, are you here? Apparently, should beat this guy up. No. Alright, there's a park across the street from Serena. I'd assume it's that one. Or it's not. Children's Park. I guess that makes sense. Hey, how you doing? And up to Daisy. Yeah, I haven't watched the newest episode of Tamayomi. Yeah, I think it's Tamayomi. Tamayomi? Tamayomi? Pretty sure it's Tamayomi. The, the baseball anime that's airing this season. I haven't watched the second episode. The first episode was good. Um, you know, just nothing really happened, just kind of setting up the characters and establishing that one of them's got this tricky pitch that they've like mastered and they never really got to use it because their fellow teammates in um, in middle school and whatnot couldn't handle it basically. And so she stopped throwing it because they couldn't catch it and it made them angry at her. So, but now she's back with her uh, childhood friend, and so I'm going to assume that they're going, probably going to try to establish some form of baseball team or club in the next episode. And if not, at least lead up to it or possibly um, go into some details on a couple of the characters that they kind of hinted at at the end of the previous one. Oh, so, well, we'll see. The other thing that I've been meaning to do is uh, I got maybe a third of the way through this Japanese drama series called Orange Days, or Orangey Days, rather. Oh, what was that? Take that. Hold on, someone's getting beaten up. Wait, where are they? Oh, these guys. Hey, hey, stop it. And it was it was actually really good. You can find the whole thing on YouTube, which is kind of nice. It's subtitled in English. So it's it's good, but they do a good job of uh, your your typical drama, you know, where there's almost always a twist or like a lead up to some amount of drama that's about to happen. But not like overly done though. There have been some animes that I've watched that were drama that it was really obnoxious and made me want to drop the series because of just like how much it happened and how stupid the characters were. But Orangey Days is, uh, seemed pretty well balanced to me, I guess. If that makes sense between like drama and twist. Oh. And the relationships themselves are pretty cute. So. Oh, it's this park. I don't see anyone here. Doesn't look like Hark is here. Alright, so we'll go check a different park. Sorry, Date. 
purgatory? That's that's the next park we're gonna check. I mean, I guess it makes sense. A weirdo in a suit shows up. Like we might as well. That salt. It makes sense that maybe if this lead doesn't pay out and we don't have any other leads, we'll go talk to the florist and he'll be able to help us. He does owe us a favor after all, so. And this is just an excuse to get me to earn money for myself or something. Yeah, I guess I'll add up one now. Nope, not yet. Look at this dude practicing his golf swing. Hey, hey, I was watching that guy. Douche. worth it, I think. Oh wow, that takes a lot of health. I guess it makes sense for the dragon style to be one of his most powerful. Interesting noise. Oh, it's the bowling ring, I think. It just sounds like machine guns. <sighs> Use me. Um, yeah, also last night I ended up staying up a little late. Um, but not actually not that late, only till 2 a.m. <laughs> only did 2 a.m., so it wasn't that bad. Considering that I've been staying up till uh, till 3 or so a lot of the time recently. Um, but only did 2 ish watching uh, streamer beat the end of Doom Eternal. So, it looks like a, you know, a fun game, I guess. Uh, I played the 2016 one, not all the way through, but when I was, uh, one night when I was making dinner, my housemate... My housemate uh, was playing Doom because he's the one who bought it and whatnot, and he was having trouble with the level. So, he asked me to work for it. Uh, do, 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 do. Sorry, to work on it for him. How am I doing on health anyway? You know what? We can probably afford to use one of these. Actually, let's go to the barbecue place real quick. We'll just fill up our health that way. Oh, Devil's Florist Mantis. I actually just wanted to get into the restaurant faster, but okay. But yeah, it was fun, and I, I did beat the level yeah, that you couldn't beat for him. Um, he doesn't play games as, as much as I do. Let's go for the triple barbecue. Inexpensive and it'll fill us up. Ho oh, ho. Oh. But it was fun. It, like quick gameplay, um, satisfying feedback. Like when you hit something or shoot, or explosions go off near you and whatnot. You know, it you feel it in the controller and visually, like the shakes and everything else. It's it's done really well. So I was. I think it's probably a little bit different watching someone play it than playing it because from what I saw last night when I was watching. Um, 
the action is definitely really, really fast and looks really good and interesting because it's got this uh, like vertical component to it which you can kind of run around and do a whole bunch of things. Ooh, combo. Very nice. Um, but it, it didn't... I don't know why. There were some parts where it didn't feel like it had that tactile response that I had uh, seen before. So, it's a lot. But I'm sure that when you actually play it and you get that feedback that it's probably fine. I think if I ever did play it though, we're going to... Uh, yeah. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's go around this way. I haven't gone around this way yet. There might be an item I haven't picked up or something on the ground. Or weapon shop. Probably need to fix something first, but I want to know what he has. Got cards. And comfy shoes. Mine spray. Uh. Hold on, I, I want you to fix something. I'm pretty sure at least one or two things are broken. That is expensive. Uh. Well, thanks. Looking for any shinies. Okay, we'll save. Um, but yeah, I, I doubt that I'll I'll play it on stream though, because I'm probably not going to buy it because I'm not terribly interested in doing. Like, I think besides that little bit that I discarded and being those levels for my friend, um, the last time I played any Doom was on a demo disc for the original Xbox when like Doom Three came out or something like that, and uh, Game Informer magazine used to send out, or was it? Maybe it wasn't Game Informer, it might have been uh, Xbox Magazine that sent out the demo discs that you could put in. Those demo discs were a lot of fun, and I kind of miss them sometimes, because there was this neat thing where, like, when you got the disc, you, like, press a certain sequence of buttons, and the controller would start to vibrate more and more until you unlocked a special demo. And some of them were really awesome, and it was just this nice Easter egg. Uh, where's the florist? I, I like call slash like send his desk down. Get, get out of the way. Wanna, okay, maybe not. Weird. Okay, I'm confused now. The pink was on the door. So, you know. Okay, so maybe I just need to ask around again? Or check different parks. I thought that it was leading me to go into here. Like, go, uh, talk to florists or something. But maybe I just need to talk to the homeless guys. Like, I'm not crazy, though, that, that that red right there makes him... Oh, wait, but I know there's red there, too. Eh, maybe I misinterpreted it. Hey, did you see a little girl? Oh. No, I'm, I'm busy. Yeah. Mm. Also, I feel like he just said something funny, but I didn't quite get, get to read it. Or maybe it was something outside, and I just totally missed it. something. What's going on here? Wait, it says look? What was the... 
Doesn't look like Harkin. Oh, we're just checking parks. That's why. I'm betting that she's across the street from Serena. And it wouldn't surprise me if Nishki already has her. I'm not, I'm not looking forward to seeing Kiru and Nishikiyama like meet again, especially since I'm expecting the worst from it. Just tone of voice and just like the complete lack of respect that Nishikiyama had. I mean, you know, he is a higher rank than Kiyu, foes, right? But still, they're go dice. Hi, side quest. I wonder if I should get a tattoo. Amazing club who's no longer on a flower tattoo. You don't mean Mizuki, do you? Yep, I think that's her name. Anyway, I want to copy the design, so I'm looking for a master tattoo who's named Udabori. You know I can find him? I wouldn't bother. Eh? Why not? Listen, a tattoo is a personal and permanent commitment. Not something you get because it's trendy. There are so many people in my life that I wish I could tell that to. <laughs> Trust me. I'm telling you this for your own good. Find a design that's yours and yours alone, or don't get it. That's just the way it is? Yeah. Well, music will wound up involved with a bad crowd. You really want to make yourself look like a target? Uh, your point. Yeah, um, you can do whatever you want with your own body. Um, but for me personally, a lot of the time, tattoos don't look good. <laughs> like, people get very gaudy tattoos, in my opinion, sometimes. And such. And, like, that's... You know, that's coming from someone whose brother has a tattoo. I think he only has one. I think. He has one of something that actually matters to him. Um, and then... A good number of my friends, especially my female friends, just have, like... Six or seven tattoos. And just like accumulating, and like, like I was, I was hanging out with one of, uh, with her and one of her friends, and they were talking about it. And her friend had just gotten her first tattoo after some encouragement by other friend, and you know got the got the bug as it were. Because people get, or they say that's like an addiction, where like you once you get one, you want another one, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And it's just, it just. The way the conversation was, it just sounded like they were basically trying to find things to waste money on, essentially. Like, it didn't really have that much... That many deeper, uh, not much deeper meaning. But again, do whatever you want. Some tattoos look really nice. Other ones... Stardust. Haruka shouldn't be in there. Hmm. This wasn't the plan. We we're supposed to meet Nishikiyama. A clock. Serena, not across the street. Oh, my and who are you? Oh, there she is. Okay. Oh, uh, but he has a gun. Haruka! 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 お嬢さんが持っていたはずのペンダントはお渡し願いますストップ<笑> そこで止まってください。ペンダントをこちらに投げてください。はるか、すまない。<笑> 
Nice bullet time. I did hit that armor, not you, Dante. Okay, it's just a flash room, little girl. Fine. She's doing a good job, though, not crying like that much. Okay, you want to stop pointing the gun at me now? Nope. Mysterious organization. Of which many of them have guns. Alright. We're gonna go beast mode. Because if we do... Ugh, if we do... Oh, they all have silencers? <laughs> yeah, whenever I get too far away, they start shooting. But assuming I stay in peace mode, um, I should be able to block some of the bullets every now and then. Just because the uh, this defense move, <sighs> the defense move does block against bullets. I think, although you know, being cooped up like that's not good. We need to mainly focus on the the guys with uh, weapons first, though. Two guys with guns still? So I just need to take them out first. Is the guy who's like directly in front of me the super mysterious man? He must be. Yeah, because he's too good. <laughs> Jeez, man. Those are a lot tougher than the other ones, right? Like every time I get up, back down for the count. This should help though. Just you and me, buddy. There we go. Oh, it doesn't get rid of his gun, though. Thought I was going to disarm him. Yeah, actually did the sweet move. Sushi. Oh, a kick in every now and then. There we go. <sighs> Just a lot of health items, but I mean, what do you expect? Niski? No, curious. No, Wow. That's the name of the Chinese place around the corner from me. <laughs> I just thought their bean sprouts were good. I didn't think they were kidnapping. I'm not yeah, it's a life lesson. 
俺もお前に謝らなきゃいけないことがあるんだちゃんと聞いてくれるかうん水木お前のお母さんなもう死んでいたんだすまない俺は助けることができなかったごめんごめんなハルカ Give him a head pat, Haruka. He is taking this much better than I thought she would. Oh, right. The, the owners. Hey, how's, how's it going? Just shot up your hostess club. I was in the room and I was in the room. I was in the room and I was in the room. I was in the room. Uh, Tanum. Oh, I didn't think that was going to happen. I didn't think that was going to happen. Or that no, wasn't trust. That was the other guy who said that. Uh, um, nothing worth selling your life for. Oh, Hannah. オンに来る。ありがとう。まあいいって。ここなら薬座も警察も攻めては来ねえ。安心していいぜ。キリュウ。俺は一度署に戻る。You だてさん。須藤。ここはセラの殺害現場です。4課の伊達さんが何か。そうだな。邪魔したな。10年前のあなたは私にとって目標だった。的確な捜査、周到な計画、そして事件への執着心。どれをとっても刑事として一流だった。
気晴らしにならねえないやいや話はこれからですそこの売り場の女に話しかけてみてくださいもっと楽しい場所に案内してくれますぜアルカは携帯電話持ってるのか持ってるわけないじゃないひまわりにいたんだからなんだ伊達さんが最近はガキでも持ってるなんて言ってたがさすがにみんながみんなってわけじゃねえんだなクラスの子はみんな持ってるよ放課後はいつもメールで待ち合わせしてたりするしえ文通でもしてるのかおいらおじさん、yeah. <laughs> メールも知らないのさすがに遅れすぎ何メールって手紙のことじゃねえのかカムロ町って Oh, that's so good I'm really, I like those moments <laughs> 手紙でないだけで Oh, that's so good Okay, um Interesting place with a lottery. Taihei. And Nakamichi, I think is what he said, right? Oh there. Lottery booth. Alright, we'll go uh we'll go fight Majima, maybe. Oh that lottery booth. Oh wait, is she not with us? No, okay, she is. Does her, does her jacket have a rip on it? I'm sorry. Oh, her jacket. Even though her arm got shot, her jacket doesn't have a rip. What is this? Kurara? I think? Or Kurara? The Kun Fu mixed up when it comes to Katakana. I want them to keep having a little conversation, it's cute. Uh, down this street, I think. Back up on the drunk. Oh, alright, or not. Hi, street punk. How you doing? How dare you interrupt my happy little time with our tiny little sweet innocent girl. How dare. I want more like culture shock moments for Q. Like him not understanding what email is. Fantastic. Also the Majima sensor just went off. Where are you, buddy? Majima? Is that you? No. Sorry. <laughs> Beat up people more than I do. No. The sensor, though. Why are there so many of you? Shame not to use the last three hits of it, but worth it. Yeah, he caught. Don't mind if you're walking around in a dangerous part of the neighborhood. This tiny little girl. Fine. Mixed reality photo studio. That sounds cool. I want to leave her behind. Like, I know she'll catch up with me, but it... It still makes me want to watch, like, nor walk normal speed when she's nearby. Just because I feel bad. <laughs> Oh, 
How dare. Use this teapot. Oh, well, you managed to survive. You did. Very nice. Tea kettle attack! I enjoyed the silly notion of, that there's a piping hot kettle just sitting on the sidewalk. Alright, come on, Haruka. Wait, is it? It's Haruka, right? Not Haruko. Okay, I hear you, but where are you? Majima? Buddy? Yeah, I'm, I'm waiting, I'm, don't worry. Wait. Wait, is it, is it that? Majima, what are you doing in the sewer? Are you much fun? <laughs> Nothing else is going crazy. I don't see a snakeskin jacket. I'm just looking for an old friend, Haruka. Hi, lady. あら、お兄さん、何か聞きたそうな顔してるわね。ああ、あいつから聞いたのね。ちょっと待ってなね。入場するには10万円分の掛け札を先に買ってもらうけど、いいかしら。Really? Sure. Gambling house wooden tags. You know, when he said somewhere fun, I was expecting somewhere fun to like bring Haruka, not an underground gambling ring. The secret door. You could see the hinges. That's cool. Alright, what are we playing here? <laughs> Yahtzee? Oh wait, no, it's a diff Oh, it's this game. I remember playing this with the homeless people in Yakuza 0. <laughs> ここにはいいよ。はい、入ります。さあ、はった、はった。ちょ。いっせのいい子だ。ちょ。All <laughs> <laughs> right, go with what she says, buddy. ります here we go. How do I... Trust her hunch. 200. Oh, snake eyes. Even. Not bad. Alright, even. I'll keep betting 200 each time. Ooh, very nice. Hmm. Alright, there's no way he's gonna do it three times in a row though, right? Also, I need to look at these names. Dog Breath Kamio, Lucky Kyohei, Hungry Tetsuyo, Sissy Yu, Eager Donkichi, Rookie Yama and Quiet Kisuke. Ah, uh, look at that. I knew it would be three dozen in a row. 
<笑>はい、あの、すみしさんがやるライトスタイム。超半コマ、揃いました。私の半。ああ。全然だったんだな。え、how so yeah, you got ice cream. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, <お待たせしました。年の瀬が小便が近いもんで。笑> one way to, you know, play out the fact that you just cheated. Like got your die or something. 次はね。入ります。入ります。さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ、さあ。超じゃね。これは。はい。超半コマ、揃いました。26の超。全部。He tried. No calling him out on his cheating though, okay? It's because he went to the bathroom and picked up his loaded dice. Hey, come on. Oh. They're cheating. Sure we are, buddy. Gambling house bodyguards. Can Kyu go anywhere without getting into a fight? Took a lot of damage there. Wow, that looked painful. Ah, oh, darn it. I don't like it when they're messing with my heat. Is that any more sushi? No. Deal with Tetsu a little bit. Shoot. It's like the worst one to get caught into fights with. Off of me. Ow. Not there. That's rude. I, I know I can upgrade my abilities. Now is not the time. Ooh. Learning a little bit maybe from Majima there. Oh, that was a good hit though. Uzaki looks a little bit tougher than the other guys. I'm definitely gonna need to restock afterwards. 
I'm not, I don't feel like I'm particularly good at this game, like combat wise, but it, it's fun all the same, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm not in brawl mode. I was hitting the counter button, thinking I'd turn around and hit him. But, but this works just fine. Wait, 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 wait. wait.手前、ここの仕切りをやらせていただいております。that's an experience for the kid. You got a hundred thousand yen. Worth it. All right, no deal. That's such a weird sentence if you take it out of uh, context. Hey, take the little girl to purgatory. Like, mm, okay. Fun little side quest, though. I mean, it seems a little odd to bring a little kid in there, but yeah, it's fine. The real question is, how many people are we going to run into on the way back? Oh wait, I need to buy... Uh, I need to find a convenience store. I just want to weave. Okay. Casual bar for drinking and relaxing. Not the place for a kid. Adult video store. Also probably not the best place. Barbecue. Okay, we'll go to the drugstore even though it's a little bit further out of the way. It's still sort of on the way. It's... I think the drugstore will have better things for us. Oh, leave me alone. What kind of street ruffian decides the best person to attack is someone who probably looks like a dad considering he's got a little kid with him? Haruka, what have we learned? Hi. Uh, I would appreciate a couple of these and a couple of these. Maybe a couple of these. And 
that shit is all I need to use. Uh, it doesn't quite get our health all the way up. Okay, that's pretty close. Cool. I, I talked to him. Why did that hurt you, Harka? <laughs> I think having the smaller ones is sometimes helpful. And we're halfway to spending a million yen. So, kind of nice. Okay. My goal for this stream is mainly just, uh, you know, the, the interaction between Nishiki and Q at Serena. That's what I want to see tonight. Sprint, Kiri! Sprint! Okay, come on, Hargo, run! Good. Is that anything? Ah, oh, darn. It looks like it. Wait, what's that? I can check something. Oh, there is something here. Block a key. I feel like it's worth it to check suspicious looking alleys. Mm. I don't know if I can get past these guys though. Unfortunately for them though, Oh, those glass. I'm actually hitting some of the quick time events. Nice. Traffic cone connector. Just throw that into your pocket, Q. Majima? I'll see you. Gorgeous. That was this? Gorgeous. -s 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 -s? Gorgeousness. Do I need to talk to you? Lost soul of purgatory. Oh, so this is that wherever you go. Trouble's not far behind. Yeah. Yeah, it tends to be the way of it. I wonder if, like, Kiryu's ever getting into this much trouble, like, normally. Yeah, pretty sure he killed Sarah. Yeah, pretty sure he Is he still our best friend, though? <laughs> それにしてもキリュウ。お前10年前とあんまり変わってねえよな。そうか。自分ではよくわからねえが。あれなんか見てみろ。白髪がどんだけ増えたと思ってんだ。それだけ何事にも全力で当たってきたってことだろう。あい
Ah, well, all customers do clean that. We cannot pretend that we're a debt collector can visit you. Are you comfortable with that, sir? Seriously, I have no clue. I have no clue what this loan is about. A strange, you have all personal information you use to apply right here, including this phone number. Are you going to say you won't pay? There's no way. Huh? No way I'm paying. You're just spouting a bunch of nonsense and you want to listen. Awfully sorry, sir. May I please have your current location? Who knows? I'm standing near some park. That'd be West Park by chance? It's Majima on the phone. More personal solutions customers like yourself would be convincing to stay current on payments. Dispatch a professional debt collector to visit you shortly to work on the issue. It's Majima. <laughs> professional debt collector. Hope you understand what that entails, sir. Easier for everyone if you simply made a payment while you still have me on the line. No thanks. Send your best. That's so. It's disappointing that it has to come to this. This will have to be handed on our terms, sir. If you ever change your mind and decide to pay, bring the amount due to the West Park entrance. Hand your pay over to our associate in the suit. And get over before you next move. This is all behind us. Better go find that suit man at the West Park entrance. Oh, you despawned Majima! Damn it. Well, I'm pretty certain it's Majima. Here's the West Park entrance. Now to find the suited man. And for you, Majima. Oh wait, that's not Majima. Oh, the guy from Jin. What? Hey, you the deck collector? Must be the one we were just on the yeah. phone with. Yeah, that's me. I'm waiting for you. Do you have the past due amount of 240,000 yen on you? I don't have that kind of money. Yeah. Huh? What you're saying is you have no plans to pay us back. Yeah. I don't remember ever borrowing 240,000 yen anyway. Hey, for a dumbass debtor trying to default on his debt, had a pretty cocky attitude. When a kid knows how to get back what they borrow. Told you. Never borrowed anything. Fine. Not to plan to pay up, I'll just have to beat the money after you. All right, menacing man. You despawned my Majima encounter. So, I'm gonna kick your ass. Because I wanted to see my bestest bud Majima, and you ruined it for me. What's this guy's deal? Strength is insane. Hmm, there he is, a scam artist. Now listen up. What is it? Tell your boss he better not ever waste my time with another one of these stupid calls. Ever again. Of course not. Tell him right away. Here, take this. Just please let me go. You got the Sakura Storm. Oh well. A nice little board or something like that. I want to assume everyone's trying to scam me. But that's practically where we're at now, isn't it? True. We got random scam calls. It's always really irritating. Um, from we have uh, more than 50 now. Use resist guard and hemo to forcibly disarm an enemy carrying weapon. This alone has no effect on blade weapons and the weapon masters are immune. Or boost health. All of these are good boost healths. And then eventually boost attack. I like I like health. I get hit enough that it's probably worth it. Whoops, wrong button. And it is it is a pretty significant bonus. Okay. Now we go to Serena. Nope, don't have time for you. The only person I have time for is Majima. Who happens to be in front of me. Dressed as a cop again. Oh, this is a good place to fight him. There's bikes around. Hey, how you doing? Stop in the name of the law, Kirito-chan! Damn. Officer Majima. Time for another completely randomized inspection. Gotta see if you're carrying anything dangerous on you. Not much I can do about that. Just need to see what I've got on me, right? I got like a sword, a iron iron, a wooden sword, a real sword, uh, a golf club. 
<laughs> Some contraband shit, Kirachan. You're out. You found it. Scoundrel! Gonna jeopardize the very safety of this fine city. Prepare for some capital punishment. Alright, he's got more than one more than one health bar today. Ooh. Get up. Get down there, Majo. Get up. Get up, Goro. Shoot. Could have seen that one coming. See you and your fancy moves, Majima. Come on, weave. Weave, my. I think he's gonna win that encounter. Oh, uh, but it was fun though. Just barely sticking out of it. There we go. That was a good hit. I definitely prefer beast mode. Ooh, actually. Oh, I don't think I dodged it because I still got hit by that. But at least I didn't go flying. Though I'm definitely about to, I think. Come on, get up. Hold on. Uh, okay, fine. I was gonna go with the, get the sign, but the Kiwami move is worth it. Go. This should do it. Ooh, not quite. Gotta caress his upper thigh. <laughs> Damn, can't believe this shit. Let someone as dangerous as you roam free. The safety of our great city of Kanrojo is in jeopardy. I think you're twice as dangerous, actually. <laughs> it is what it is. <sighs> At least this time, but justice never sleeps. I'll get you red-handed one of these days. Uh huh. Learned essence of Mad Dog Chokehold. Nishi. You know, do you know, sir? Our boss seems interested in playing around in game centers. He was our final, but when he loses anything, he lashes out pretty harsh against his subordinates, so we're all a bit worried. Please go. be careful, too. Yeah, that's cool and all, but I don't want to really bother with that. Sorry. Um, let's go to the M store. Yeah. M store, and then we'll stop in at uh, one of these places. Or maybe... No, we'll go to the M store first. Or... Um, hard to decide, really. 
I just want to stock up on uh, healing items again. Stock up on healing items and, you know, heal myself, so stop at a restaurant and at a convenience store. Excuse me. Oh shit. Oh, that's annoying. Go away. Okay, I left. I missed the entrance when I was going around. Hey buddy, I was the takoyaki stand. Heck yeah. Oh, maybe it's not. Oh, this is what you order. Okay, here we go. I want everything. <laughs> that sounds good. I love takoyaki. I had it yesterday for uh, dinner. I think I mentioned that during the Octopath Traveler. Tonight's dinner was, uh, was pasta primavera and uh, Philly cheesesteak pizza. So a couple slices of that and then the pasta primavera. It was good. I don't often get uh, the pasta primavera stuff, but I, I've been branching out a little bit during uh, quarantine season, trying out new things just to keep things, you know, mixed up a little bit. As opposed to just getting the usual, which would be uh, basically like chicken alfredo with bacon and banana peppers. Alright, here we go. Lena, why are you here? Lena. Ten years, June and May. Nishiki, it's been a long time, brother. Lena, drink. Yes. Ten years, you drink like this. Yes. Got some distance between them. I didn't want to go anywhere. I was tired of it. そうだろうな。俺はどうしても百億を手に入れたい。お前が連れている楽器とペンダントを渡せ。その前に答えろ。なぜ水木を殺した？殺す気はなかったんだ。弓の妹を殺すつもりなんかな。at least there's maybe a little bit of regret there. But you, you didn't mean the killer with a slash on her throat. Oji! What are you doing, you guys? Sorry. I didn't have to say this thing. Who said it? Oji! ま、待ってください。弓の妹なんだぞ。誰が殺せと言った誰が殺せ親父。あとはきっちり片付けておきますから。Damn straight you will. Well, he definitely has a temper. <laughs>。10年間、俺は弓の行方を追い続けた。弓の妹がセレナで働いていると知り、俺はずっと彼女をマークしてたんだよ。いつかそこに弓が現れるんじゃないかってな。遥かの子供、それで知ったのか。巡
ひまわりにいた娘もそして登場界の百億が抜かれるだがなそれはそうだ弓の指輪だよこいつが現場で見つかったんだ弓はいる近くに必ずな桐生これは登場界の戦争だお前一人でどうなるもんでもない悪いようにはしねえペンダントを渡してくれあれはハルカにとって唯一残された母親とのつながりだお前らの戦争なんて関係ねえ変わらねえなだからユミもお前に惹かれたんだろうみんなお前の味方をする昔からなお前俺のことを憎んでいるのか分からねえだが結局俺はお前を裏切った風間の親父もなもう後戻りはできねえまさか風間の親さんを撃ったのはなあさすがにあの時手が震えたや,やめてよ二人ともなんでだおやさんに世話になった恩はねえのかよまだくたばっちゃねえだろうそれに今はシンジも一緒だしなおやさん着きましたお前シンジを盗聴して10年前のあの日から俺は誰も信じちゃいないな俺は俺のやり方で登場界のトップに立つどうしても水木の娘をよこさねえならお前でも容赦はしない好きにしろだがはるかを渡さねえお前の道具になんかさせやしねえ今さらだがお前とはもう一度一緒にやりたかっただがもう今日限り兄弟じゃねえなんでこんなことになっちゃったの、ね、なんで This new ski is a little pissant If you've played Yakuza Zero、uh, <laughs> You might remember a scene with new ski pointing a gun At、uh, a Kiryu and shaking it and not being able to actually shoot despite her basically telling him to.、Uh, he has come a far way. Very far away from that、uh, little boy, I guess. Seeing how easily he shot the guy. Hey, no fighting in Sayrna. It's a good bar. Alright, I need to keep on my family. Like, I get it. You know, the little small bits of information that we've received on, you know, his transformation into what he is now. It makes sense. It's interesting.、Uh, is any of you, uh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Did you hear that, uh, that trombone? What was that? Some good battle music. I'm kind of sad that it happened, all that it ended so quickly. <laughs> yeah. It's about right. Hmm. Yeah, we know. Oh, I really wanted him to like jump on his face or something equally badass. Oji Shindo. We have yet to see、uh, the short haired, like the short curly haired dude.
There we go. Beautiful. I do like how we have enough people to do this move, though. That was one of you. Oh, fuck you. Alright, I'll pick up one of those swords in a minute. Okay, you are a douchebag. Damn it. I just wanna- there we go. That was a good hit. That's some, some good stuff. Nice move. Except for the fact that it didn't actually really do anything. There we go. I want this. Very much Jinkei, not Geo. Get up, get up, get up. Oh good, he put it away finally. Yeah, we can use one of the significant ones. Oh no, he did. He's still a douchebag. Oh, we can do a two on I was gonna try to save up the heat. <laughs> I'm gonna try to save up the heat so we can disarm him, but. Kiwami's worth points, so let's do that. I'm trying to evade. This is not working. <laughs> I don't have any sushi. Into the wall you go. So, does anyone remember if Shindo is the guy, you know, who was there with him at the start? Like when... God, do you block? when he was given his lieutenants and such, when he was first starting off his family and everyone wasn't listening to him. Okay, so... Barely got it in. Oh, I can't pick up any of those. to swap in. Damn it, no. You're in dragon mode. Use the move where you take away his weapon. Alright. 
hasn't used a lot of health items. But we're through it at least. A one man army. Hey Nuski, how how's it going? Oh, this is a past one. Okay. I wonder if Yumi stopped talking to him because of the organ transplant thing. そうか。オンに切る。そうそう。初めからそう言えよ。ま、今日はでかい鳥立てが久々にできたんだ。組長さんあんたラッキーだぜ。ま、借金まみれでギャンブルグルイの医者にも感謝した方がいいな。医者で
that up all the way over there. Alright, well, we'll just work on this wheel, I guess. I mean, it doesn't seem like my attack power is enough to make these fights shorter. I might as well just try to live longer. I need 85 in order to start getting those. But we can at least boost the attack damage. So that's good. Look, I haven't really done too much in these. I guess I should be getting this. Just to have more defense. Here's the maximum amount of the cage. Sure. He gets a rising taunt. And Just, we'll throw some in here, just because it, it feels really weird to have this uh, this ring be so small compared to other ones. Is this? I only buy possibly. All right. Hi, buddy. Need your help. I need you to sell me at least three of those. And then, actually, does he sell? Because I have these plates that I probably get rid of. No, okay. We'll have to go to Don Quixote or something like that. Or the pawn shop, probably. Actually, might only work at the pawn shop now that I think about it. Mm, Alright, you know what? Let's hit the pawn shop. Wait, is this the right way? Oh, I thought I was a street over. That's fine, we can get there. And don't get me wrong, I do want to fight Majima, but... Eat food, we can move full. And that's, that's it, cool, thanks. Bye, clown. All right. All right, punch up. Ibisu pun. Ibisu. Oh, no, no, I wanted to sell something. But I guess I'm kind of curious. Do they have anything else that I should be using? All right, they have these things. That would have been nice. Weird how the chain is which Knocked down by tax aimed at your feet. Also handy. Yeah. Buy both of those. And then let's sell. Yeah. So this um, so that, that, we'll sell the boom chans, I suppose, and we'll, uh, we'll sell two of those pocket tissues from the item box specifically. Cool. And then last but not least, let's actually equip all this stuff. So we should be a little bit better off when we get mobbed by a family of people with knives. It would have been really nice to have that about 10 minutes ago or so. Okay. 
So closest save point. Well, closest save point I'm supposed to be back there, but I guess I'm just supposed to lay low on the streets for now. So I'll just go save. Because we're gonna call it for uh for today's stream. But thank you everyone for watching. Um hope you have a good rest of your day. Stay safe, stay clean, you know, all the things that one should do when in quarantine. Don't do what Kiryu just did. That's a surefire way to get sick. So. So yeah, um, sleep well, everyone. And I will uh, I'll talk to you all another time. Bye for now.